Howdy, lieutenants and economists. The most volatile, evil, disgusting things on the planet, humans. If you have a video request, you can always go to assholeconsulting.com. Yeah, I am gonna charge you, kids. And that is the importance of not fucking up. You are such an asshole! Hey everybody, old captain. I feel bad for this guy. Uh, when we had our email problems, um, this guy sent it in, so it was on my Cappy Cap email, and I'm like, oh shit, so I'm like going through and cleaning it. I haven't got back to this guy, so I feel horrible. So my apologies, SD. Uh, hey Cappy, I'm a freshman in my first semester of college. Who's currently majoring in finance with a minor in computer science. After re reading Worthless a few times and doing some introspection, however, I realized I am not really that interested in finance but I also don't really know why I majored in it. Good, get out of it. <laughs> There's no reason to be in it. Now I've decided I'm gonna change my major to computer science next semester. All right, good man. The computer science program at my school offers a few different degree options for you to choose from. Systems programming, computer science, uh, computer information science, computer game programming, cybersecurity infrastructure, and then computer science education. <laughs> it's called the fucking the book. It's called Your Certification On. It's called Khan's Academy. That's what it's called. You can read about them here if you want. Uh, the ones that interest me the most are cybersecurity, information science, and systems programming. Although I'm not really interested in working in the public sector, I find cybersecurity the most interesting. But well, you'd work in the private sector in that too. You you would. I mean, fuck, T-Mobile just got hacked. I think, what, 15 million clients database? So there's there's a demand for a private sector. Uh, and have heard that there's actually starting to be a lot more demand for it in the private sector. Yeah, yeah. However, I think uh, SP and CIS are also a bit more universal and might offer more job options, along with consi consisting of a lot of the same basic courses as cybersecurity. My overall question is, which degree option do you think would be more useful to me, not only in my personal life, since I'd like to start a business at some point, but also finding a well-paying job, preferably in the private sector. Thank you very much for reading the answer, uh, William. Well, thank you, William. <clears throat> um, here's the deal. It, after a certain point in time, you get to the point that you can't fuck it up. Well, I mean, you can. You could be a complete idiot and moron and have absolutely no common sense, and you're just bad at interviewing, or you just, you know, you curse at the HR person or whatever. But... Once you choose the STEM field that isn't biochem, once you get into computers, once you once you cross a certain finish line, it's like, well, then you do have some choice. It's not like you must major in this one thing and this one thing only. So I would go with what interests you the most, and that sounds like cybersecurity, because they're all good. I mean, they're all you're you're not you're not going to be unless we have I can't say for sure because the economy could always crash again. But you're going to be better off than 95% of the college, well not 95, but, but most of the college graduates, certainly more than your liberal arts and your humanities. So after, you know, you're in computer science, I know computer game program, that kind of sounds, yeah, I got program games, yeah, you and everybody else in fucking Bellevue. Um, so, but yeah, your sister's programming, information science, and the security, those are all really good ones to choose from. So I'd choose the one that you find the most interesting. And also, as you're going to notice, it you get so specialized, there's less and less variation in terms of the number of classes you're going to take. So let's say, oh gosh, you, you, you go cybersecurity and find out you really hate it or you really love systems programming. Yeah, you might have to take an extra class or two, um, but you can always switch and it's not going to be the end of the world. It's not like going to be starting from scratch. Um, but yeah, I would say do your cybersecurity, you know, keep your eye open. Um, keep a finger on the pulse, you know, take maybe, you know, a minor or something, take some other classes that'll help you towards that degree but are in the other fields. You, you also might, well, I, I don't like uh, system security. I like, I like uh, programming or whatever it is. But yeah, you're in, you're in the zone and now it's pretty hard with those three options to fuck it up. So yeah, just kind of ask yourselves a little bit of questions, sample, try a little bit. And I, here's the other thing, it's not like you can't teach yourself this shit otherwise. I mean, once you get your degree, you, you know it's going to be certifications you know you've passed that hurdle. You can always go and self-educate in these other things. So it's not like, oh, i got to go back to school for systems programming. No, you don't. You just go to Khan's Academy, you grab a book, you go fucking study, you got your degree, and just get your certification. So anyway, you're on the right track. Best of luck. Toodles.